Yes, this is Dave. Welcome back to the Smithy Showroom. I want to show you today how we put the machine up on the stand. I've got a couple of 5 8 inch steel rods. I've got the back one in place already. Okay, on the front one, let's go right into this hole here. You may have to fish it around a little bit to get it to come through on the other side. Okay, there we go. Now, these rods are a bit long, but they're ones I just happen to have here in the shop. But when you put your straps on, keep them close to the machine up here. Okay? You can strap it up and down on each side and have somebody stabilize it when you lift it up. Okay? Because it is a little bit top heavy. Right? Once it's set on your stand, whether you're using the smithy stand or a workbench you've made, get it bolted down good and secure. And then make sure that that stand and machine is solid on the floor. No movement. If you get some movement here, you may need to either shim underneath the stand down here at the floor, or you might need to shim here under the machine where it goes onto the tray. Okay, now that we've got our bars in place, I've lowered the mill head all the way down. Keep that center of gravity low. Got my strap around the back hook here. Let's put it over the front one. Just like that. Keep them in close to the machine. Close as they'll go. Put your strap on the other side. You're all ready to put it onto the end of your hook on your engine hoist or however you're lifting it up and up on the bench you go. Make sure you have somebody to help you to stabilize this machine while you're trying to move it.